I was on a business trip to Nashville, and I, I was all day, and I got to the, my motel room that night, and I took my sock off because I always explore my feet. It's a nightly routine for Wayne Mitchell. Living with diabetes, he knows even the simplest scratch or cut can quickly escalate. The big blister had developed on my big toe, and I called Yes, if we have trouble. So how long has this been here? Shortly after that business trip in 2010, Mr. Mitchell became a patient here at the Wound Care Center at the Arkansas Heart Hospital under the Dr. DePaulo. We try and minimize the amputation uh, percentage that we see. We try to maximize the therapy here. We provide hyperbarics, uh, generalized wound care. And doctors were able to eventually stop the infection in Mitchell's right leg with a rigorous schedule of hyperbaric therapy. Unfortunately, another infection set in in Mr. Mitchell's left foot, which eventually did lead to an amputation. We have a high cure rate, a very high cure rate. Of course, you know, with ongoing problems like diabetes and peripheral arterial disease, we have a lot of recurrent patients with new wounds and whatnot, and so they know to come immediately as soon as they have a wound, so that makes it a lot easier to get things treated. This year, Dr. DePaulo and the Wound Care Center will celebrate a decade of serving patients. The treatments here that we offer are life-changing because people with chronic wounds have just that, chronic wounds. They can't shower, um, they can't go to the beach, uh, they can't get things wet. It's life-changing when they finally heal. Mm, this guy did good and I still have him today. So, I mean, this is 2018 and we're still going strong. For today's Heartbeat, I'm Jancy Sheets. Today's Heartbeat is sponsored by Arkansas Heart Hospital.